Hey guys, my name is Scobie. Today I'm going to be showing you how to move Apex Legends from one hard drive to another. This is going to be a nice quick and easy tutorial. I'm going to be showing you step by step how to do everything. The method we use in today's video won't require us to reinstall the game. So the first thing you want to do is open up Origin. And once Origin opens up, what we're going to be doing is navigating to the left panel and we're going to be clicking on my game library right here. And then from here, we should see all games currently in our library. In this case, we're going to be locating to the game that we currently have installed, which in this case is Apex Legends for me. But this should work for any Origin game you have installed. But in this case, I'm just going to be doing it from Apex Legends. What you want to do is click on the game and then you should see this small side pop-up window that opens up. What we're going to be doing is clicking on the cogwheel here for settings. And then we should get some more drop-down settings here. But what we're going to be looking for is the bottom option, which is move game. We're going to click this open and then we're going to get a small pop-up window. And we're going to be able to choose a new install location for our actual game. Now, in this case, what I'm going to be doing is selecting my SANIC drive, which is my SSD, because I want this game to load faster. So I'm going to be moving it over here so it can get quicker loading times. So all I need to do is choose a location, add a folder if you wish. In this case, I'm just going to be making a new folder named Apex. Double click into the location where you want to be. Click select folder and then your game is going to be moved. Now you will notice you will get this Windows pop-up telling you how long this is going to take. So currently for me it's going to take about 4 minutes to transfer everything over. Depending on the drives you're using and depending on your computer this may vary. So you may have to wait a little bit of time for this but it shouldn't take too long. But once this is done you should have no problem loading up the game again to play anything you want. And it should work really really easily. Anyway guys if you enjoyed this tutorial be sure to drop a like. Subscribe if you're new, check out the other videos on the channel. Until next time guys, as always, keep it saucy. Peace.